Hey guys, Grumpy here with Ship Showcase, a series where I focus on unique builds. Um, in today's episode, we're going to look at the Mudskipper Mark II and why it is such a phenomenal ship, um, and how with just a little bit of investment, you can take a, a humble frigate like this and use it to um, solo capital ships. So getting into the ship itself, uh, here we have the Mudskipper Mark II. It's a pirate, uh, it's an improvised version of the Mudskipper. It's a pirate design. Um, it features one large ballistic slot. Um, that ballistic slot is capable of um, slotting storm needlers, gauss cannons, hephaestus, whatever you like. I ended up going with the Mjolnir cannon. Um, just energy damage has a nice balance between shields, armor, and hull. Uh, it's just a good overall weapon. Next up, um, I have a couple of built-in mods. So I have makeshift shield generator, militarized subsystem, and that unstable injector. And then I am piloting the ship, so I can go ahead and show off the character screen. Um, so here, we have just a couple of red perks, uh, red line perks, uh, helmsmanship, combat endurance, field modulation, you know, some of the basics that you're used to seeing. Um, we also have a little bit of blue line with energy weapon mastery. Of course, having the Mjolnir cannon, we want to make the most of it. And then gunnery implants. Um, but nothing too crazy here, just a couple of elite skills. I'm not really going overboard, uh, just a few here and there. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and go back to the ship. And I'm going to demonstrate this frigate uh, going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the capital ship and destroying it. Um, I think the... I think the... Um, Mudskipper Mark II gets overlooked by a lot of uh, players. I don't see a lot of people including this in their fleet, and I really think they should. So here we have the Atlas. Um, the Atlas is considered a capital ship. So we're gonna see if these, if the uh, Mudskipper can take down this capital ship solo. And like I said, it doesn't take much to get this ship going. Um, as you saw, I just had a few perks here and there. Um, only a few hull mods built into the ship. Not not that many. Um, some people would say, you know, well, it requires three story points to get off the ground. Uh, that seems like a bit much of an investment. But I mean, some of the best ships in the game also require, require three hull mods to really make the most of them. Like uh, the Hyperion you know a paragon so i think the mud skipper is definitely uh worthy of a three story point investment and as you see here we have no problem taking down this capital ship um in enough time we're definitely going to make short work of this ship i'm going to go ahead and vent i feel safe perfectly safe going back here uh, venting behind the atlas Ooh, nice we even get an overload and one last shot should do it easy as you like um i think that's a pretty good example of um what you can get done with a humble little ship like the Mudskipper. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, look to include it in your builds. Maybe you'll like it. Maybe you'll enjoy it. But other than that, Grumpy out.